Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can start your Windows 11 operating system in the safe mode. So for this, what you need to do here is you need to press the shift key on your keyboard. So just press the shift key on your keyboard and then click on this power button. So press the shift key and then click on power button and then click on the restart button. So once you click on the restart button, you will be able to see this kind of uh, window where you can choose from these options. You need to choose the troubleshoot option. So just click on troubleshoot and then click on advanced options. Now at this point, you need to choose startup settings option. So just click on startup settings. And then here you will be able to see all these options. Here you just need to click on restart. Now you will see this option. Now here you can press the keys F1 to F9 to select the options from this list. So at this point we need to choose the number 5 option which is enable safe mode with networking. So I'm going to press F5 key on my Windows 11 operating system. So just press F5 key on Windows 11 operating system. And now what this option is going to do is it's going to start your Windows 11 operating system in the safe mode with networking, right? So once again, you will see the login option. So just provide the password which you remember and which has to be correct. So at this point, I'm going to provide my password and I know that this password is correct and I'm going to press enter and now at this point you will be able to see this kind of window. Now here as you can see we have started our Windows 11 operating system in the safe mode so the desktop background will be black this means it's started in the safe mode and you will be able to see on all the four corners this safe mode option. And from this, you know that your uh, computer has been started in the safe mode, right? And you just need to restart your computer now. So you just need to click on the Windows icon and then click on the restart option here, which is going to restart your Windows 11 operating system. So now my computer is restarted. So I can uh, just try my password once again and then press enter. And this time, hopefully, you will be successfully logged in to your Windows 11 operating system. 